Yes, I w would like to meet the London patient very much. Uh, um, I would, would say take your time in, um, if, you, if you want to become public, do it. Um, it. It's been very useful for science and for giving hope to, um, to HIV positive people, um, to people living with HIV. Um, and uh, um, so I would encourage you to become public someday, but um, take your time and uh, um, do what, what's good for you. And, uh, um, and I'm so glad to have a, a, a family member added to my family. <laughs> Thank you very much. I'll tell you when the sidewalk ends. It's quite a way, so. I knew I was the only person cured of HIV at that point, and I didn't want to be the only person. And so um, I have pretty much gave, gave my life up, my other life up, and um, that became my mission. And because and, I felt like I had a moral obligation to make sure that there were more of, uh, or more of me. <laughs> I'm very happy for this patient. Um, uh, However, um, it's not, not a, um, a cure that's going to cure many people <laughs> because, because you have to have the, uh, at, at this point, you have to have the um, blood cancer to get the stem cell transplant for it to be ethical. If you want, decide you want to come out to the public, uh, I think you will make a huge difference in, um, in sharing the, the it's not really a burden that I'm going through um, with media and stuff like that. It's actually fun. Um, so uh, you can share in the fun. <laughs>